The Chamber of Pharmacy Ghana says it will henceforth demand payment guarantees before supplying medicines to health facilities which require their services. The chairman of the National Executive Council, Harrison Abutiate, who made this known, said some facilities have not paid for drugs supplied for more than three months. According to the Chamber, there are companies which have not been paid by the NHIS since April last year. As a result, service providers have not been able to pay for supplies. Some of the health facilities, mostly public, have not been able to make payments to its members for the past 12 to 24 months. If nothing is done, first, these companies will collapse. Some have already laid off staff. I know the manufacturers too are involved. They are, they are also going through the same problem. CEO of the chamber says there's currently no room to make official complaints, urging the NHIA to form the adjudication committee as stipulated in the NHIS Act to give room for such issues to be addressed. Reacting to the issues, a source at the NHIA told us the authority does not procure medicines directly from pharmaceutical companies but deals with service providers and hospitals. The NHIA expects service providers to pay pharmaceutical companies out of the various claims payment it has made. The source added in 2020 alone, the NHIA released 68 million CDs towards claims payments to service providers towards the settlement of the arrears, 30 million CDs of which was to settle for arrears for medicines. The NHIA currently owes service providers between four to seven months arrears depending on the facility. Meanwhile, the NHIA will meet the Chamber of Pharmacy next week to address their concerns. The year has started. New consignments have been delivered. And there is, does not seem to be any hope of payment. So if they say April, again, it's like waiting to die before you are paid. The Chamber of Pharmacy Ghana has a membership of more than 2,000 wholesalers and distributors and about 10,000 over-the-counter medicine suppliers.